Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Sim Airport. We're back again, and if you recall from our last episode, we were going to be working on our new security area in this episode. So what that means is, is that there's going to be some disruption in our security procedures as we build the, the new section down here. So what we're going to do is I'm going to... I'm going to dismantle these two body scanners. So we're only going to have one body scanner for right now, which may be a terrible idea. But, well, hmm, thinking in my head. So if we build, hmm, yeah, let's go ahead and start the process of building out the basement first. And so what we need to do is we need to figure out where we're going to put our queue line so let's start by putting in let's put in some foundation I guess because we can always expand the foundation as they come back up here and they go back upstairs so I think what I'm gonna do is they're gonna come down the steps and we're going to remove this planning part down here um, at least this section of it, we're going to keep that so we know where that, that's the stairs. These are the stairs right here. Um, we're going to call the stairs pink. So we know that's the stairs. So what we want to do is let's think about how we want them to f flow through here. So when they come in... If they come off of here, say they come down a corridor to the left. So they come down a corridor to the left. And like if we did something like this. And then from here, they start the process of going through, um, let's do, so they would, let's say we get another 20 down just for giggles. Um, Q start Q Six. So if we have six starting, okay. So what I want to do is like this. So we go this, and then, and I'm kind of, and we go. Let's say we go, come down, and then we go back up. I'm trying to think if I can make a queue that would just wrap like this or not. I think I can. So we can get rid of this. And then the next will come up like this. So they'll come in here, go here, up this way, back down this way, and then up this way. And this is where our that'll be. So... Let's put in something like that for all of these. So kind of like kind of like that. I'm trying to visualize how we want this to look because I want people like I want the throughput. So this would be one, two, three, four, five of those. So once they've got into there, uh, give me my planned wall. So. Once they've got into here, they can come down here. 
And I want to put a wall here. And so what I'm thinking is, let's clear this. They come into this part of the security area. And then down here at the bottom is exit only security area. So like the exit gate, the exit part. So they can't go back this direction. I'm, I'm thinking, you know, like I'm probably overthinking this. So then they come in to where they come into the next security zone. And it is one, two, three. So like this. And then we have, I wonder how long, let's see how long that is. So bag scanner, we want a remote bag scanner. So it is, oh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Is that right? Yeah, so it's seven. So if we have them come up here where the remote bag scanners are, so plus the body scanner, so body scanner, the body scanner is uh, two by two. So I would need them to be seven, so three, three wide and so basically like a three by seven. Um, so if we put in, let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five of those. So it would be doing some maths in my head. So it would be um, oh, sorry, five times three is 15, 15 wide in here. So if we come back here to planned wall. So we need to have it 16 here. And then there is a well corridor right here. And that goes back up the steps. And you can put things, well, it's supposed to be pink, right there and right there, and then right there. So then they can only go upstairs. Like it's a, it's a filtered process where they come in here, come down here, and then we have, um, let's do cyan here. So one, two, three. So seven and two, 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 two. Their bag scanners would be right here. Like that. I filter through there, they come into here, and I mean, and then I guess you would have queuing lines here. So our queuing lines would be, you could, yeah, queuing lines here. Let's say we clear that one just so we can see it better. So then we, they have five queuing lines right here for the bag scanners. And then they come upstairs, and their only option is to go out through those gates into where the passenger area is. I like it. I like it a lot. It's going to cost a lot of money. So let's start by putting in foundational work, because that's what we're going to need. So... Um, that and that. And that, and 
this, I guess. We'll put that in. All right, so let's put... Let's do... Oh, 313,000. Well, let's get that put in. We'll get as much as we can get in here. All right. Well, there's that. So let's uh, let's speed up. Let's watch the construction, and we'll have to we have, we'll have some walls to remove, but we should be good once this construction's finished. So once the construction's finished, uh, we'll we'll jump back in. All right, so phase one of construction is done, as you can see. And we have the place where we're going to start our queuing for the security. So let's get our security zone in, at least over here. So I'm going to do it like this. And I think what I'm going to do is, so there's no confusion. Um, no, I think it'll be okay because I, I was going to put in some gates right there, but I don't, I don't think I'm going to do that. Security. Exit. Um, also, always have to remember that I need to be like that. Excuse me. So we want our security exit. Like that. So we can put that guy there. So then we can also put, and I'm going to go ahead and do this. I'm going to say none for the, well, it goes right, yeah. So I'm going to put none right there, and then I'm going to go back to security. And I'm going to put in a security exit. And listen, if it if this doesn't work, then we take it out. But uh, for right now, I'm going to do it like that. And then I'll put my security zone back in. And I think we can now put in the rest of our foundation. Yes. So I will wait for this new construction to finish, and we'll be back in a minute. Okay, we're back again. Uh, next thing we need to do is, one, we have to wait on us to get money, which is going to be tight. But it's going to be worth it. So back again and rotate. Entrance, 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 entrance. And again, security zone. Actually, I, I don't No, We don't want. Oh, you know what? You know what I just realized is that. This has to be all one big security zone. And so we do, we have to take out, okay, so that that's fine. We can do that. Um, dismantle, 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 and dismantle. That is fine. So now we can just make this all one big security zone. And I am going to dismantle that. All right, now let's get some carpet. Let's see how much it is to carpet all of this. 25, okay, so we're gonna wait on the carpet for a minute. Uh, we're going to get the we want to do the um, security. So ID check stand. And it is going to be one, two, three, four, and five. And then go Q U E U E Q. Q 
get our cues in here. And then we can unplan all of that. So unplan all of that and that. And come back over here to our wall. And I'm going to put in, I want to see if that puts the end cap on there because that's really what I want to do. Um, so now we need a bag. Remote bag scanner. We need one, two, three, four, five. Oh, we got to move the wall over one. That's fine. Foundation. We can add a line of foundation. And do a dismantle of all of that. Bag scanner. Remote bag scanner. Actually, just do security, because then we need a... Oh, nope, we want a um, um, body body scanner oh, are you kidding me baloney okay so dismantle 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 and dismantle move them on over so we can, planning, we can clear all of this now. Let's, un, let's clear all of that. Come back over here to our body scanners. So it has to be like this, and then there'll be one, and the, we'll add in our remote bag scanner. Body scanner. I'm, I know, I'm just trying, uh, so the reason I'm doing it the way I'm doing it is because I don't want to mess it up. So, body scanner. Because I've already messed it up enough, you know what I'm saying? One, two, th one, two, three, four, because we want to have five. Remote bag scanner. So... I need to put in, there's like two blocks here, so planning, and then, so, no, there's one block separation, so what we have to do is body scanner, that, and it can't be next to the wall, so there has to be... <clears throat> A piece of, a little bit of separation there so we have to build that that's what we have to build so how much is that going to cost us okay we can build that it's probably mass hysteria going on upstairs in the airport we just don't even care we're doing stuff we're doing stuff All right, so this one will be assigned to that queue. This one we will assign to this queue. This one we will assign to this queue. This one to this one. And this one to this one. Okay. Close. All right, so our queues are, si are good. Um, let's get in here. Let's dismantle this wall. Uh, 
Yeah, we got to get a remote security station. So just hold your horses. Body bag. Body scanner. Remote bag scanner. Okay. Remote security station. We're going to put this guy... I'm going to put it down here. Like in the middle, between them. Right there? Right there. Okay, security... Okay. Sector can... Yeah, I haven't built the stairs up yet. That's fine. Um, Q. Q-U-E-U-E. -U -U -E. So we, ha we can come down here like this. that look the same? It does not. Shrinkage. And the nice thing is, is that eventually I will be able to put it in so the, um, one of these is like First class only. You know what I'm saying? And I'm putting all this in, and there's a good possibility that now that I'm thinking of it, that it might not be able to use them. So, but we're putting them in anyway. You know what I'm saying? Advanced security... I think I'm going to need something for that. Um, which will require us to put go upstairs. And dismantle these two. Pause. Dismantle. Dismantle. We should have enough staff at that. Okay. Let's go downstairs. And then we're going to go stairs. We're going to go stairs. Stairway up. Right there. And down to planning and clear all of this. So now it should be able to be vacated. Right? Maybe. It's going to really slow down our, our time for a moment. Sector cannot be vacated. So we may just um, up. Let's get rid of this planning. Clear this. I think what we're going to do is wait until it. Wait until the end of the day and dismantle all of this. And then we're going to wait because some of the security will go downstairs. Be some very angry passengers. Which I could just put in um, 
metal detectors for right now. What are we at? 8 p.m. Metal. I don't know. Let's just do that real fast. They're backwards as well, so... Everything here is fine. I'm fine. You're fine. How are you? So you gotta do what you gotta do, is what I'm saying. There'll be some very angry folks. a normal airport you're just taking forever to get through security well I think they also all went downstairs so like I had some of the security people go downstairs Honestly, what I could do is... I, could, I know what I should have done. It's fine. I'll fix it all later. What I should have done is this. Should not have done this part. And then they would have all been upstairs... Like, well, I've went through security, but my airplane already took off. So what we're going to do is we are going to, we need advanced security. So let's check our, we haven't done any research. Do we have advanced security unlocked? So we need a CTO's office. So this is going to be a little bit of a crap show for a hot minute here. So let's get rid of this and let's come over here to our queue. And we're going to shrink this queue. Um, get rid of that. Dismantle that. Um, dismantle that. Q, U, E, shrink this queue. Okay, so then we're going to put in some walls and a door. This is going to be a staff door. Uh, zones, none. Right here. Door. Staff door. It's going to go right there. We're going to go to office. This is now an office. And then we need a, an office desk and an office chair. It's probably going to tell me requires enclosed space. It's fine. It'll be there in just a minute. See? Look, we're good. All right. Planning. Clear that. And then we need to go to our admin staff and we need a CTO, right? Let's look before we do anything. 
Advanced security requires a CTO. CTO. Hire. Well, he's already technically hired, so... He's not here yet. Okay, now he's here. Advanced security. Now we gotta wait 24 hours. So... What we're gonna do is we're gonna unplan all of this so then I can see all of this. So let's unplan all of this. And this is this is all fine. Um, we're not gonna hire nine staff just yet. So I think we're good down here. This is the security zone. Um, yeah, we're good right now. But hey, that, that looks good. It's kind of a mess up here. It's fine. All right, so we're going to wait for this research to complete. we got about 21 hours to go, and once that research is done, well, is there anything else we could do while the research is researching? So really our plan was just to do all the offices and stuff today. Let's take a look at our government grants real fast. So we have done, we've completed the basic airport. Uh, the next up is the passenger experience. So build five stores, two first class lounges, and get the passenger satisfaction up to 80%. So basically what I'm thinking is here, that our stores, because one of them is like a pharmacy, candy, books, um, we can do so if we do display, display, so we can do a bookstore, a candy store. Um, clothing, bookstore, candy store, clothing and jewelry, pharmacy, and makeup, pharmacy and makeup, and then a souvenir store. So that'll be the five stores that we have. But that's also going to require us to expand our airport. So if we were going to do that, we could... Let's see how much our foundation is over here. $178,000 to get it to... Well, actually, we want to put it to probably right there. So $200,000 is how much we need. So security is going. It is working. Um... The automated ID check. We probably need to put some of those. I, You know what? I'm thinking, do we want automated ID checks down here? No. No, we don't. I was going to say, we could leave them upstairs. But no. We're just... Er, everybody's got a queue. Listen, everybody's got to go through the TSA. It's fine. So we'll jump back in once... Our CTO office is complete, and hopefully we'll have enough money as well to continue building other stuff. So we'll be back in just a moment. All right. The advanced ticketing is complete on our technology. So let's go ahead and go back downstairs, and let's go ahead and rezone all of this for security. So rezone all of this for security. And assign to here, 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 and here. And then it says sector cannot be vacated. So I think I need to get rid of, let's try. Those are stairs up. 
let's do this. Let's dismantle this and this. And see if that allows it to be vacated. We good. Sector cannot be vacant. Okay, so let's get rid of... Maybe it's these. I'm just going to get rid of them and, you know, call it good. That's what I'm going to do. Okay, must have been it. Let's go back upstairs. And what we're going to do is we're going to dismantle all of this stuff. And eventually we'll have escalators. Q U E U E shrink Q. And then we're going to say zones. All right, well, let's see what happens. Let's get all this stuff out of here. Oh, see, this is what I, unex, unforeseen, unforeseenness. So now if we go back downstairs, we see people wandering through everywhere. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. So that means we need to get our, let's pause for a second. Go back into our planning tool. Let's get our planned walls. Right here, and then one, two, three... And a wall. One, two, three, and then a wall. One, two, three, and then a wall. And we were going to put that right there. Okay. Let's go wall. Wall, wall, wall. Dismantle. And then we need another wall right there. And then we need a wall here, 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 and here. And then we're going to put a door, a staff door, in the middle, right there. now just stuck in here <laughs> you're in my world now grandma <laughs> oh goodness I'll put that there put this wall back and then um, doors Staff door, staff door, staff door, staff door. That was just... Don't go back in there! No, get out of there. These people, I swear. Okay, let's put our carpet back down. Carpet... Carpet. Okay. That was just something else. Okay, so let's go and see what this looks like.
Oh yeah, we wanted to assign to. Oh, can I not? Oh, I thought I. I was hoping I could do. Maybe can I assign this to it? Okay, all right. Assign that to there. 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 I was hoping I could assign those to Qs, but apparently I can't. Assign to... Okay, so I can assign it to this ID check station. That one. That one. That one. And... That, wait. That one, that one, that one, th that one, and that one, right? Now you can't assign a queue, so I can just get rid of all these queues, I guess. So I didn't need all that. All right, so... Shrinkage. Third time's charm. We're still paused. Or not. Can they not get into... Can they not get in here? Do I need to, maybe this has to be, um, dismantle those? I wouldn't think so. Oh, yeah, they couldn't get in and get out. Okay, well, that's... That's fine. So my only concern is the those passengers aren't going to come down through there anyway. I mean As orderly service. But I could, you know. I could, um. I'm thinking here. Q U E. I know there's a way to select the queue. Maybe it's... Okay. So if we did this, we could make this flight crew only. I don't know if flight crew goes through security, but we're going to find out. I would assume so. And we can make one of them first class only and see if anybody goes through first class. So we could say, you know, like this guy is... doesn't have the flight crew on it.
No flight crew here. And then down here. This is no coach and no flight crew, so that's first class only. I don't know. Because then we could also say, like, I don't know, I'm thinking in my head. Uh, so we do have some first class passengers. I saw them coming through there. As far as I can tell, everybody's getting on their planes correctly. Sector is not accessible. Why is this sector not accessible? I'm going to go down here and I'm going to put in security exits. And so it would be this way. Correct? I think I'm correct. I don't know. We'll find out. Yes. Now... Must be a functional store. Sector not accessible. There's some flight crew going downstairs. I'm looking at something real fast. I think these would need to be on the other side. You know what I mean? Like, I'm going to do something real fast. I'm going to assign to, and I'm going to unassign this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to dismantle this one and this one. And I'm going to put it on the other side. Body scanner. And then remote bag scanner. Yeah. Okay, cancel. We're going to put it back the way it was. We're just going with the way it was. It's fine.
Okay. Okay. All right. So this is perplexing as to, I don't know, dismantle the door maybe? And then put it back? I've dealt with this before, and I just don't remember what I did to fix it. But we're definitely going to put the door back. And maybe it's this staff door? I wouldn't think it would be the staff door that was the problem. Because that guy needs to go... I mean, I think he can go... I wonder what this is, so... Yeah, I'm just, I'm not sure. I'm kind of reading what it means, and I just don't. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to try this out. I'm going to go here to this, and we're going to go like this. And then I'm going to put this in here. And then we're going to assign this to assign that. Close. Okay. sliding door and now I need to put a wall in okay so basically what it was is that I quickly read on the interwebs that once you change security stuff around sometimes you have to unzone things and then rezone things so that's just what I did so all is well again question mark um what we will be doing is let's go ahead and zone out these offices that one that one and that one office Chair. Okay. 
Okay, so we zone out those offices, and then I think I need to do, um, I'm thinking in my head that I need to do a office. I'm actually going to put all of these as offices for right now. There's a lot of stuff I know that I need to, to do. Those chairs are offset. It's terrible. We're just gonna let it go. So when we come in here and then let's look at our staff. So let's check out our security. No changes need to be made there. We're good on our workmen. This staff is good. Um, chef, janitor. That's one thing that we need to look at is how much garbage. Okay, garbage is being picked up. So the one thing that we need to do is we need to hire a an opera a COO because we need to do we need to deal with our um, pickup and drop offs. So I'm kind of going at this slowly. I mean, we can do advanced ticketing, ability to sign aircraft gates to specific ticketing zones. I don't really need that right now. So uh, I almost am inclined to fire the CTO, but it might break some of the stuff that I already did. So I'm going to leave the CTO there. But I think we need to hire this because I want to do... Gate related options allows purchase of additional map parcels. Like, we need all of this stuff for sure. Um, because I might be able to get upgraded buses to start off with, and then. If we do lower prop, we definitely need lower property tax. So we have to have four because then you need a VP of finance. How many of these people we need? Manage admin staff. So one, two, three, four, five, four, plus the sales rep, which would be five. And we have one, two, three, four, five offices. So. Let's go ahead and do our COO. Hire them. And I mean, we might as well hire all of these. I don't want to, but let's just start with that one. They're just so expensive is why. And then we need to expand our airport, but Let's get that. Okay, so we got our COO, and our next step is going to be doing um, upgraded buses. So we're going to do upgraded buses. We're going to get that going. And that way we get more people able to get here faster is basically what it is. And then let's go ahead and, oh, let's make sure we got garbage. We got bins everywhere we need to have them at. Bin? I don't know. Put one right here and one right here. Maybe one right here. One right there. Oh, we can put our carpet in, though. Carpet. Put our carpet in. Almost inclined to put some vending machines down here. I mean, vending machines. You know what? I oh, no. See, does it have to be in a security zone? I'm going to check remote security station used to monitor indoors only. 
so because what I was thinking was is that I could put a walls around it, you know, like just wall that in and then put glass in there. That's what I think I'm going to do. So like Can I not can I not put wall in? Well, let's let it finish the carpet then. Look at all these fine folk coming to the airport. I mean, honestly, I could put, you know, first class only on one thing, but I want them to, you know, have the option of, you know, with all the normal people. Yeah, so our next thing is expanding to gate number four, because we're definitely with having some higher expenses now, we're definitely going to need to expand our airport more. Now, I don't know if it was putting... Yeah, because I was, like, right here, right? It does not let me do that. For some reason. I mean, what if I unzone that? Uh, zones. None. Actually, I'm going to see that. I want to see what happens if I unzone this. Yep, has to be in the security zone. Come on, come back. Yep, definitely has to be in the security zone. So never mind. <laughs> All right, well, at least our carpet's in, right? So that's fine. Okay, so plan of attack for the next episode. So going forward for this series, this is episode number... Well, let's see. For, this is episode five. So Sim Airport will return in two weeks for episode number six. And there are three episodes left, six, seven, and eight in this season of Sim Airport. So we have three more episodes in this season. It's not going away permanently. It's going away as we transition to another 10-week season of something else. So uh, in the next episode... Ooh, did we get our thing? In the next episode, we are going to continue expanding the airport as we have been this whole time. We're going to get gate number four going. And the, the plan is, is gates all the way down. And then we will be able to purchase this land. And then once we have that land purchased, we'll be able to add gates going this direction as well. So expand down. And then maybe when we get down to the bottom parts... Uh, we can upgrade our from small gates to large gates, so all small in the front and then have like larger over here on the side. But that also means we need to expand our runway. So lots of stuff to do in the next uh, couple episodes after this one. So what did I say? Six, seven, and eight? Is this episode six? Anyway, the next few episodes here for Sim Airport. Uh, thank you so much for all the... Likes, comments, sub subscribes, and all that stuff from this series. It's been a, a lot of fun building the airport and, you know, 
making it good and all that stuff. So very, very much appreciated. We will see how the security zone and everything handles a lot more passengers. I think it'll be okay. Until the next time, back here in the Sim Airport, take care.